my tactics and do whatever I need to do. You know, sometimes I'll lag a fight and I'll just win some rounds if I feel like I lost a few. I'll do what I need to win a few and then later on I'll look for that knockout once again. You know, I like to get the knockout early and then I like to get the knockout late. Really, I just like to get knockouts. Keith, okay. <laughs> before the fight you were saying, hey, I'm not Amir Khan, I'm not Sean Porter, there ain't gonna be no draw. What do you think about fighting Amir Khan or Sean Porter in the future? Great fights, great fights. And then I'd prove it even better to the next degree because fighting Julio Diaz, that's like, that's like, you know, um, that's like a friend of a friend. Everybody knows his friend and that friend has a relationship with all of us. And then, you know, um, Amir Khan screwed him over, Sean Porter beat him up, but Thurman laid him out, you know, so, and, and retired him, you know what I'm saying? So we, we all have that in common that we've been through Julio Diaz. Which is, which is nice, but which one of us are better than the other? Mm. Is Sean Porter better than Amir Khan? Is Amir Khan better than Keith Thurman? Is Sean Porter better than Keith Thurman? That's a real nice little trinity you got lined up. Keith, throughout, throughout history, the great fighters are defined by who else is around them, you know, their rivals. Do you feel at the moment, from 140 pounds to 154, we're really seeing something special in terms of opposition. There's so many challenges out there for you to, to really prove you're you know, one of the greats. Definitely, this is, this is almost like a golden age of boxing. This is, we're bringing boxing back and I'm thrilled to be a part of it. I'm thrilled to, um, to really bring that next dimension that I'm happy that there is a Keith one-time Thurman as Keith one-time Thurman and as a fan in the sport of boxing today because you know, everybody loved Manny Pacquiao, but even his days are thin, you know, and here, here we are, you got a devastating young boxer puncher who's 25 years old and isn't afraid to go up against anybody in the world of boxing, you know. Am I all hype? Show me. Prove it. Just beat me. Just beat me. <laughs> I'm not afraid to be beat, so just beat me, you know. The, there's many guys out there who really, they they rather fight somebody else. Mm -hmm. Everybody rather fight somebody else. They rather make their money in a, somewhere else in a, in a different city on a, on a different card and just don't talk about Keith Thurman. Well, you know, Keith Thurman's here and we're going to be talking about him a lot. But that, make it, that makes a problem for you, though, at 25 years old, like you say, devastating puncher. No one's going to want to fight you, regardless of where you are in the rankings. You're going to be avoided, aren't you? Possibly. <laughs> that is a possibility. But, you know, we'll, we'll see, you know, um, fighters deep down, we have a certain level of pride. And I'm just waiting for, not a prize fighter, but I'm waiting for a pride fighter to step out and step into the ring and, you know, be the competition to Keith you, you seem to talk, you know, we're talking about welterweight and like middleweights. You know, the, the era of the Four Kings, you know, we're talking mm, now yeah. about this era. Are you the Marvin Hagler of this era? Are you are you that type of fighter rather than the Her who are you? Are you the Hearns? Are you the Duran? Because you seem to talk like Hagler. You want to yeah. meet straight in the middle and sort it out, and, and then go and have a beer together as men or whatever it be. You seem to be that kind of talker. See, I'm the evolution of all those greats because being a young young man growing up in this generation with with the YouTube and everything, I've watched them all. I've watched them all and they have helped build my spirit as a fighter. I look into the past and that's what I want to live. I want to live the life that they once lived, you know? Which is fight the best, man, you know? I mean, in reality, I, I forget what I said. I, I said it to another guy, you know, these belts are all really nice and I want to be a champion, but it's not about the belt. It's about the recognition as a champion. You know, I'd fight just as hard if it was over a box of Kellogg's. Yeah, yeah. Everybody, the thing is, the